So, now let us do a last minute revision on the subject of physics for class 12 CBSC. So, we will cover up the chapter number 8. So, that is the electromagnetic waves. <coughs> so, we have the important formulas at a glance. So, given here we have certain important formulas. So, written I naught equal to epsilon naught into d phi divided by dt and number 2 I naught is also equal to epsilon naught into d by dt of E a and that is equal to epsilon naught into a into d e by dt and I naught equal to c into dv by dt and further we have phi into b into so dl in the vector form equal to mu naught into ic plus id and k equal to 2 pi by lambda and c equal to so 1 so divided by square root of mu naught into epsilon naught in vacuum and for in a material medium we have c equal to so 1 divided by square root of mu r into mu naught into epsilon r into epsilon naught and for a wave propagating along x axis we have E y equal to E naught into sin k x minus omega t and B z equal to B naught into sin k x minus so w t and u e is given by 1 by 4 epsilon naught into E naught square and that is also equal to further so half into epsilon naught into E r m s whole square and u b is given by so 1 by 4 pi epsilon so epsilon naught into so B naught square and that is equal to 1 by 2 into mu naught into B R M S whole square and U average is given by half into epsilon naught R E R M S square plus 1 by 2 mu naught B R M S square equal to B R M S whole square divided by mu naught and P is given by U divided by C and the intensity of the wave I is given by P by A. <coughs> and further i is equal to u a v into c and that is equal to epsilon naught into e r m s whole square into c and s vector is given by 1 by mu naught into e vector into b vector. So, thus we have seen certain important formulas at a glance. So, now we will see certain graphs for say for a plane progressive electromagnetic wave propagating along the z plus direction the electric and magnetic fields can be written as shown here we have e equal to e naught into sin k z minus omega t and the magnetic field b is given by b naught into sin k z minus omega t and the amplitudes of electric and magnetic fields in free space in an electromagnetic waves are already related to E naught equal to C into B naught or B naught equal to E naught divided by C. And further the, the electromagnetic spectrum so can be understood as like this. For the radio waves the spectrum ranges between so lambda greater than so 10 to the power of 8 nanometer and this application so is among the radio and TV signals. And for microwave the spectrum lies between 10 to the power of 8 and 10 to the power of 5 nanometer and has its application over so microwave oven and radar. And for infrared waves the spectrum ranges between so 10 to the power of 5 and 700 nanometer and its application lies in the night vision. And for visible light the ranges from 700 to 400 nanometer and his application is observed in the world. So, to observe the world and the ultraviolet rays has a range of 400 to 10 nanometer and its application is to destroy the bacteria and the X-rays has a range of 10 to 0 0.01 nanometer and its application is useful in to detect the bone break or fracture and gamma rays has a range of 0.01 nanometer and the application is in the area of to treat the cancer. So, thus we have made an important and last minute. 
the last minute uh, so understanding of the formulas and glance and made a quick revision of the subject of physics in the chapter number 8 so thank you